Rachel, I can't do this anymore. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired of being the one doing everything, taking care of you. And the most painful thing is that you cause this with your own hands. <laughs> because you never listened. You never. <laughs> Do you know how many errors you've committed just because you never listened to me? <laughs> From the first day of our marriage, I would always want to give you an advice but you felt I had nothing to offer. Look at us, we are neck deep in debt. We can't even afford your hospital bills just because you, 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 you would jump from one wrong investment to another. And I would tell you, don't do this, don't do this. But you say, no. What do you have to tell me? Thing is not supposed to be. I mean, it's supposed to be. Look, what do you know? Huh? That was how that other lady got pregnant for you. following you, coming for counseling, counseling from one counseling to the other and I kept telling you, I said this lady is after something. Richard, she lured you into sleeping with her, you slept with her, she got pregnant, they removed you from being a minister. That was the day you started falling. That was the day you, you started losing the presence of God, you, you stopped going to church, you stopped doing all that. And I remember that morning, this whole thing happened. I had a dream. I woke up and I told you, I said I had a dream that you died. And all you did was just wave it off. I remember going downstairs to your car and I noticed that one of the bolts were removed. I told you. What did you tell me, Richard? I think you should check your tires. I noticed one of the bolts of the front tire is a bit loose. What do you know about cars? What do I know about cars? Now you can see I know a lot about cars. Was it not just Five minutes after you left the compound that I got a call that you had a fatal accident and look at you. Now I have to feed you, I have to clothe you, I have to bathe for you, I have to do everything for you just because you didn't listen to me, Richard. You never listened. See what you've done to us, see what you've done. And this is because you never listened. You never. And most times your what you would say is, oh, Adam listened to Eve and Eve made him fall. It's not every woman that has bad advice. Women who have the spirit of God hear from God and sometimes their instincts speak to them. And I have the spirit of God in me. You didn't even listen to me for once. God, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. So much debt. We can't even afford you. Oh, God. <laughs> if only, if only you had listened. If only you wouldn't be in this. <laughs> 